how it's changed me. Not everybody had the success, has the success that I did. It's not typical, is it possible? Yes, but is it the typical Jamboree fantasy? Of course, but it's not a real expectation for women. I don't expect you to go on Facebook and you know, say, Jabber, I just bought me a brand new car, whatever. It's the small things. I mean, people were coming to me before the house, before the car, before Elite. People were coming to me because I was excited and I was passionate. And that really attracts people. I mean, if I seen a friend of high you know, a friend from high school on Facebook having all this success and saying how she got credit cards paid off and how she's making all these new friends and um you know, she just seems happy. I was not a happy person before Danbury. I was pretty, I was negative Nancy. I was the one, you know, you guys know the Time Hop app, right? Okay, so when I scroll through mine on a, every day, and I look back at like three, four, and five years, I shudder with embarrassment. I'm like, I cannot believe I said that on Facebook. Like, just complaining and miserable. I mean, I came from a rough place. Like, and then especially after the hurricane, losing, Everything, I was bitter, I'm not gonna lie, I was so bitter. And it wasn't until you know, I found Jamboree that I found my happy place. And when people see in my transformation, just not financially, but just me as a person and how I went from being a negative person to this happy, positive person that looks forward to life every day, um, that's attractive to people. So they, they come to me and they're like, I've seen what it has done for you, and I want that to do it for me. So just know that 